Hi everyone, welcome back to the Daly Society and welcome to a little bit of a celebration here today. It's my birthday, I'm 49 today, and to celebrate, Pattern Emporium are giving away two of their brand new patterns, the beautiful Dream On dress. So if you wanna find out how to go into the running to win one of those patterns, stay tuned until the end of the vlog and I will let you know how. Before I go any further, to never miss out on an episode here, make sure you are subscribed and you hit that notification bell to keep you updated when I upload one of my new videos. So we're here to talk about the wonderful new pattern addition to Pattern Emporium's catalog, and that is the beautiful Dream On dress. Now this beautiful Dream On dress was actually very similar to the Every Days a Weekend dress. You guys love that dress. It had beautiful tiered skirt on there, a lovely knit fabric. This is a very similar style, but much more fitted. was an outpouring request from uh, the Kate did say that people wanted a very similar version to that every day's a weekend dress but more of a fitted bodice so, so she's decided to come out with this dream on dress which is uh, a lovely fitted bodice with that same tiered skirt so if you already own the every day's a weekend dress and you want to just uh, get the add-on pack you can do that the add-on pack just is the actual fitted bodice and the sleeves and neckline so nothing uh, as far as the skirt you can use your other every day's a weekend skirt pattern pieces for that so so if you haven't uh, bought the Every Days or Weekend dress and you prefer this fitted bodice style, so you can just go for this Dream On dress itself. So let me show you what it's all about. Firstly, I've made it in this gorgeous double brush poly from Lush Fabrics here in Australia over in Perth. They do still have some left. It's a gorgeous uh, paisley, very boho inspired print. And I love this warm red color. So let me show you this dress. I've gone for the beautiful maxi version, the regular length skirt, so the tiers, you'll see the maxi tiers and the fitted bodice. I've made it in a size, straight size 14. I've done the regular, just fitted sleeve with the add-on cuff at the bottom and I've gone for the higher rounded neck. Now the necklines in this are higher neck, rounded mid neck and scoop neck and you can also have a great little high sort of rollover polo neck as well if you're wanting something a bit cozier sleeves uh you've got the fitted sleeve with a cuff which is what i'm wearing here you can do a bishop sleeve which is a beautiful elasticized wrist and a short bishop sleeve and for you guys in the northern hemisphere there is also a sleeveless version that has self banding or binding around the armholes and kate has actually done a great lookbook. you can see all the ones she's made she's made quite a big variety in all different fabrics um, you can use anything as far as knit goes nothing too heavy so we're talking about uh, double rush polys rayon spandex cotton interlock as well ba bamboo model and rayon stretch knits and this as i say is a double brush poly i love working with this fabric it's really lovely to sew up and i've just done the gathering with the normal basted stitch two rows gathered it all up i haven't used elastic this time because this fabric is not too overly heavy so it's uh, really easy to gather up and as always great instructions from pattern emporium patterns you won't go wrong you really have your hand held right the way through if you're worried about doing things like gathering skirts and tearing um yeah she will uh, kate will take you right through those instructions so they're fantastic so no need to worry about that i love the bishop sleeves and i really want to make another one of these in the short bishop sleeve uh maybe in the midi length as it warms up over here in the weather i would definitely be making more of these this one i've added a little tie on i just think it being a fitted waist this one adds a little bit more definition whereas the every day's a weekend is a bit more of a boxier style wider fit you didn't really need to do that shape this one i just think having a little self-tied belt really just adds that little bit of extra shaping to it now don't forget this pattern also comes in the skirt pattern so you do get uh the extra waistband as well if you wanted to do either midi mini or maxi skirt i've made a skirt to show you in a minute uh, and it's also all the patterns that kate will show you in her run through of the pattern 
all those patterns are on sale as always. And I'm gonna show you each and every one of those uh, because I've made most of them in the past, just to show you what is on sale and to take advantage of it. The sale runs from tonight, Thursday night, Australian Eastern Standard Time until Sunday night. So it's a great time to grab a bargain. I do have affiliate links below here if you are wanting to go on to order through those links. They won't cost you any extra, but they do help to support the channel. So yeah, don't forget the other set the pattern on sale there as well to snap up those on a great price at the moment too. back here to show you the beautiful dream on skirt this is the maxi version as well stand back and show you Another double brush poly from the wonderful Lush Fabrics. How awesome is this zebra print? I love it. You can see the length of that. And I'm pairing this with a pattern emporium pattern called the BUT. Now the BU isn't on sale with all the other patterns, but I love the cow neck version in this, and I sometimes use this cow neck in some of their other patterns. You know with pattern emporium patterns, there's a lot you can mash together. You can mash sleeves with some, necklines with others. So it's really worth collecting a lot of their patterns so you can really become your own fashion designer. So I've made this just in a knit polyester, really nice sort of, feels like a merino, but it's not. But with the cow neck, I've actually made it in size down than what I normally would have made it in a size 12 because I wanted a bit more fitted. But I love the high low. It's got the shorter front and longer tail back. And I love doing that kind of French tuck or half tuck. You have the back out and the front tucked in to show the beautiful waistline. Now with this uh, skirt, I've used a non-roll elastic to stitch the sides down so the elastic won't move around. But I love the tiered version of this. I love the long maxi tiered version, but I also love the midi version. I want to make more of these skirts because they're so comfortable. You don't have to worry about zips and buttons, elastic to pull on and off, but also it looks really cute. I think the little ankle boots. Um, yeah, for a front stand back. Little ankle boots there. And also a great one to wear through summer with a little t-shirt top. Uh, yeah, there's so many different varieties of t-shirts with Patton Emporium patterns, you really can't go wrong. So I love this combination. Definitely a winner for me, this skirt. I would love to have many more of these in the wardrobe as well. So this is the Dream On skirt. They are my two versions. I've made size 14s in both of those and a size 12 in this top. I'm going to show you all the other patterns that are on sale at the moment. So stay tuned. I have a wardrobe full of Patton Emporium patterns. And I've got to say, I can never get enough when they do get released. I just have to jump on board and grab them because I know I've got that versatility of chopping and changing, wearing some things with others and making my own wardrobe full of their patterns to get a variety of different looks. Uh, the other one that's on special at the moment is the Keep It Simple Bay, which I've made in a merino. It's got the higher neck. I love wearing that's a bit more fitted than this one, but Great pattern to wear for layering underneath a lot of garments if you're wanting something a bit warm and cozy. So it comes in t-shirts, in long sleeve t-shirts. It's got different necklines as well. So that one's on special at the moment. I'm gonna just put it on my arch. <laughs> the other one on special is the Unwind sweater. Now I've made that in a fleece from last winter. I've also made it in a t-shirt version. That is a fantastic sweater. I've seen it done in merino. I've seen it done with a hood. I've seen it done in t-shirts. It's just a boxy style the easiest pattern you can ever make basically a front and a back piece and a neck binding and then a waist binding if you're wanting to put that on so you see this seam down the arms two pieces how easy is that to put together so great for a beginner sewist next one on special is the timeout tank that i've made in a lovely crepe stretch fabric the timeout tank is brilliant i actually made a few of these in staple colors as well but these are my two kind of fancier versions great cutaway binded armholes 
fantastic for using for things like um, active wear as well as dressing up for a good basic to wear underneath like layered. So the timeout tanks are on special as well, as is with the Besties tee. This is a flared style t-shirt. You can make this in a lot of different lengths and a lot of different necklines. I've done it in a uh, squared neckline and I've also done it in a normal kind of boat neckline. Two totally different jersey fabrics there. But what I love about it is you can also make it in more of a tunic length with a flutter sleeve. That one is in a stretch crepe from Lady McElroy Fabrics. Love that for over a little um, three quarter style, kind of like um, oligony cigarette style pants all summer. I've worn that one quite a lot. So the versatility of the Besties tee, you, that is the t-shirt you need. If you like a flared t-shirt to wear over the top of things, that is a great basic staple to have in the wardrobe as well. One of my all time favorite tops that's also on special is the Hello Gorgeous top. And that is because of the wonderful half dramatic sleeve and the squared necklines kind of rounded as well. This one was one of my favorites. I wore right through summer and also made it in velvet uh, and the black velvet lace as well. But that is this cotton jersey from Spotlight. That is a fantastic pattern. I really love the Hello Gorgeous. And you can also add longer sleeves with the hack um, that you'll find the mashable patterns to go with it as well. If you wanna make a long sleeve version, you can do that. Hello Gorgeous, yeah, it does come in a longer style sleeve as well. So it's a really pretty little t-shirt top. Definitely one that I wanna make more of for next summer. And last but not least, uh, there is also the, now let me think there's another one, the Game On top I haven't made. That's an off the shoulder style top and the beautiful True Romance Bishop sleeve top, which you guys love that one when I did a, a try on for Mother's Day. You can make the Bishop sleeve with the deep cuff on the bottom, or you can make just the normal Bishop sleeve with the elasticized um, bottom there. Different necklines, different lengths, a bit more of a flared style length. Uh, shape as well so what a great lot of patterns on sale at the moment time to take advantage of their things while they are on sale and there is a brand new pattern coming out in the next couple of weeks katie's working on i think everyone over here in australia new zealand uh, and all the southern hemisphere wanting some cozy cuddly things to wear to keep us warm that is coming very shortly so i think it's going to be very exciting to show you something very different from pattern emporium uh yeah so so much on special so much to take advantage of don't forget if you're wanting just to add on your fitted bodice hack you can do that if you already have the every days a weekend dress you can add the fitted bodice and that will give you the sleeves and everything as well but if you're wanting to purchase this dress it's a great time to do so being on sale now let me talk about the giveaway i am running a giveaway i wanted to get to 10k and I actually already got to 12 and a half by the time this video has come out which is amazing my birthday is on the 6th of july so i'm filming it on the 6th uh, and i wanted to be at 10 for that so i it's well exceeded that i'm just so thrilled and just so appreciative of everyone that's watching and, and also commenting every week because it does bring more people to the channel the more interaction i get on a, on a video uh, the more people can find me so how to win a free pattern from pattern emporium Firstly, you need to subscribe to the channel and to like the video and also make sure you write in the comments why you'd like to win a Pattern Emporium pattern uh, and I'd love to do a random draw there. There'll be two people chosen and it can be worldwide as well because it is a PDF pattern. It'll be getting sent straight to your inbox. So good luck, everybody. Fantastic uh, to see you're all really enthusiastic about these patterns every time they're released as well. So if you've liked this, don't forget to press the like button. That would be great as well. I'm gonna go and celebrate for my birthday. Just a small gathering today. Next next year, the big 50. Well, let's see. Hopefully, if the world's in a different place by then, it might be party time. I might be feeling a bit better after my surgery, which is scheduled for the 9th of August. So I'm gonna feel like a new person, uh, definitely for the big 5 for next year. So I am off to celebrate the 49th. I'm gonna have a bit of cake and just have family around and have a very quiet day. So I wish you all a wonderful day and a wonderful week and jump on board and have a look at these patterns in the links below. See you soon. Keep safe and keep sewing. Bye for now.